Seven Local News has spent a day with the Rural Fire Brigade as it prepares for the coming fire season by conducting controlled burn-offs. It comes as local crews have been kept busy lately, attending to deliberately lit grass fires around the city. There's no taking it easy on the weekend for these dedicated men and women. They volunteer their free time to help protect the region from devastating fires. This operation in the Paluma Range National Park is just a small part of the work brigades around Townsville have been planning and conducting all year. We're more proactive now rather than being reactive to fires and that's the change. Um, the more work we can do prior to the season, um, it works to diminish the risk for us later in the season. It also provides a good opportunity for our volunteers uh, to get some training. Part of that proactive approach is to educate rural landowners on their responsibilities. We've got more people um, moving out into the rural areas. Um, there's more blocks for us to do. They're not farming areas anymore. Um, they're smaller 100 acre blocks and a lot of the people aren't used to what the requirements are of that. With more than two thirds of the northern region already drought declared, hazard mitigation burns like this will hopefully prevent a horrifying season. That's why we're here today because we don't want to be here in October. Uh, when conditions are a lot more severe. Rural fire brigades attract different people for different reasons. 27-year-old Victorian Carol Marshall became a member earlier this year. Her friends were caught up in the Black Saturday fires. So many people were affected, lost houses, a lot of lives are lost as well. Um, yeah, you don't feel you want to be able to do something. Jessica Howe, 7 News.